Welcome to the Elective Rotation Podcast, Critical Care Pharmacy Minute, where I discuss one critical care pharmacy thought in about one minute. I'm Pharmacy Joe of PharmacyJoe.com. For mild to moderate cases of serotonin syndrome, ciproheptadine can be given. Ciproheptadine is an H1 blocking antihistamine, but it also has serotonin receptor blocking activity. Specifically, it acts to block 5-HT1A and 5-HT2A receptors, which are the receptors responsible for the symptoms of serotonin syndrome. The typical dose of ciproheptadine for serotonin syndrome is 12 milligrams. This can be given orally or by gastric tube. This dose appears to have been arrived at based on a 1998 case series in which five patients with serotonin syndrome were treated. All patients were given 4 to 8 milligrams of ciproheptadine. Three of the five patients had symptoms resolve. The remaining two patients had a partial response, were given a repeat dose of ciproheptadine, and then had a complete response. If this initial dose of 12 milligrams is not sufficient, ciproheptadine can be continued at a dose of 2 milligrams every 2 hours until symptoms resolve. For more on how to approach serotonin syndrome and other inpatient medical emergencies from a pharmacist's point of view, get my book, A Pharmacist's Guide to Inpatient Medical Emergencies, at clinicalpharmacybooks.com.